President of the Pan American Mixed Martial Arts Federation, Jason Fraser, paid a courtesy visit to Minister Responsible for Youth Development and Sports, the Honorable Kenson Kazume, Thursday morning to discuss a range of issues, including the Pan American Games, an international event happening in Trinidad and Tobago in July, and to lend support to the St. Lucia Mixed Martial Arts Federation. Fraser was accompanied by President of the St. Lucia Mixed Martial Arts Federation, Louis Andre Murray. During the visit, Mr. Fraser presented over $3,000 U.S. dollars worth of equipment from the International Federation to assist in the development of the sport on island. We have further bigger things coming forward. We'll be sending an octagon to St. Lucia. The International Federation will host 50% 50, 50 of it while we look for the corporate St. Lucia, the government of St. Lucia, the people of St. Lucia to find the other 50% so that we can ensure that octagon come home to St. Lucia and remain here, which will help develop that. Minister and I discussed a few things, you know, the Pan American Games coming up, the international event that is happening in Trinidad on July 1st. Most importantly, the international certification course for coaches in Trinidad along with officials, which will be on June 28th to the 30th. And then we discussed also the first female who will be coming out of St. Lucia to compete at that competition. Minister responsible for youth development and sports, the Honorable Kenson Kazimi stated that mixed martial arts is a sport he wants to develop all around the island. Of course, if you're going to develop the sport, you would need to ensure that you have the basic equipment needed. And of course, today we received a quantum of equipment from the president of the Pan American Federation, and we're very grateful for that. Um, we're definitely going to ensure that our young people get the opportunity to apply the trade and to develop. Um, we also spoke briefly on having a uh, octagon in St. Lucia, which would be very critical for the sport, and uh, the government of St. Lucia pledged support for having that uh, be brought into St. Lucia, stored in St. Lucia, so that we can have competitions and events. Meanwhile, President of the St. Lucia Mixed Martial Arts Federation, Louis Andre Murray, is pleased with the way the sport is progressing in St. Lucia. We'll be having an in-house event of local athletes for mixed martial arts. It'll be the first event, and as Mr. Frisier said earlier, it's a historic event because it's the first time we're actually having civilian out on the shores of St. Lucia. Last year, we actually came through with two medals, um, and we did very, very well. We've been working for the last two years, and the new executive, which I have assisted in, assisted in building, uh, working towards that. So Mr. Frisier came over to visit and to show his support, the support of the International Mixed Martial Arts Federation for our new budding and growing sport in St. Lucia. The interested parties say they are working on having St. Lucia represented at this year's Mixed Martial Arts World Championships scheduled for Abu Dhabi in November. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.